San Andreas feels like the primary focus for this trilogy, and because of this, some things bleed over from that game into the others. One thing that I think most of us noticed immediately was the use of San Andreas menu sounds in Vice City, instead of the original menu sounds. For example, here's what the menu sounds like on Classic Vice City. And here's what they sound like in the definitive edition of Vice City. So yeah, it's not the same sounds. It's the San Andreas sounds, and it's kind of odd. The mod Fixed Menu Sounds fixes this issue, restoring the original Voice City menu sounds to the Definitive Edition. Take a look. The next mod we'll take a look at is Fixed Garage Door Sound. This mod is simple, it fixes the garage door sound when it opens and closes, as it loops incorrectly in the Definitive Edition. And the last mod we'll cover is Colored Radio Icons. In the Definitive Edition, the radio icons in the radio wheel are white and lack their original colours. While I think this works for San Andreas, it looks odd for Vice City. Colored Radio Icons restores the colours in these icons, and I think they look much better. So let's install these mods. Keep in mind, installation may change in the future as the game gets updated and mods get further developed. But for now, here's how to do it. We'll start with fixed menu sounds. Step 1. Download the mod from the link in the description. Step 2. Open the archive you just downloaded and copy the game face folder from the archive into your Voice City game folder. And that's basically it. Let's move on to installing fixed garage door sound. Step 1. Download the mod from the link in the description. Step 2. Open the archive you just downloaded, open the folder within that archive, and open the Voice City folder. Step 3. Open the Game Face folder in your Voice City game folder, then navigate to Content, Packs, and copy the Mods folder from the archive into your Packs folder. And lastly, let's install Colored Radio Icons. Step 1. Download the mod from the link in the description. Step 2. Open the archive you just downloaded, open the Game Face folder in your Voice City game folder, then navigate to Content, Packs, and then copy the file from the archive into your Mods folder. If you haven't got a Mods folder, just create one. And that brings us to the end of this mod showroom. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content like this.